The Chinese government has pledged to boost support for Somalia's education sector, mainly in science, technology, engineering and mathematics, or STEM subjects. The commitment was made during the annual Somali STEM summit, which concluded in Mogadishu on Tuesday. Mohamed Kahie has the details. Abdulazak Abdullahi is a science teacher at Hano Academy in Mogadishu. Together with his students, they were invited to this annual summit to showcase their innovations. He says most of the robotic materials are not locally available and importing is a big challenge. These materials are not locally available in our country, but if we get the capacity to produce here, we will get more opportunities to train more students to produce quality products for applications in our daily lives. Abdul Rahman Elmi received much needed finance to support his business from event organizers. He established a small scale coconut processing farm in 2019. Now his products can be found outside the country. Our products are now available in Turkey and Kenya as well as several other places. We are working to expand our small-scale processing into large-scale factories to be leading coconut oil production and distribution in Somalia and abroad. To encourage technological innovations, especially tech-based large-scale farming, the Chinese ambassador says his country will increase the number of scholarships for Somali students in support of peaceful reconstruction of the Horn of African state. And in recent years, we have also provided, I think, more than 1,000 full government scholarships for aspiring Somali students. And to my statistics, more than 80% of them are studying in STEM subjects, medicine, telecommunications, engineering, so on and so forth. And I'm sure that their education in China and their experience gained in China will also go a long way towards helping the peaceful reconstruction of this country. On their part, Somali STEM society are calling for more innovators to come forward in the next coming summit. We want to encourage more innovators to come forward, know what the STEM is all about, be part of the innovation that we want to see within our community so that we can create more employment. Somalia's industrial development was impacted by three decades of conflict, but many hope assistance from partners like China will help rebuild the sector. The organizers of this summit hope the innovations showcased today here will help resolve key challenges facing Somalia, including security, while modernizing farming activities. Mohamed Kahir, CGTN, Mogadishu, Somalia.